Oh, oh. Stay right there. Don't move. Gwendolyn and I are working on your surprise. I won't peek. I can't wait to see what it is. Oh, Gwendolyn, your lunch is ready, and your cousin is waiting. Thanks, Grandma. Love, have you been taking all your medicines? Well, I'm not sure what good they're doing. I'm still stuck in this bed. Yes, you are. You're still here. Ah, oh, you know what I meant. It's just that I'm going stir-crazy in here, and I don't even want to think about all the addendums that still need approvals. Everything is taken care of, but you need to rest before you feel better. I'll rest after your birthday. I still have to prep your special batch of chocolate chip pancakes. Oh. You have baked those pancakes for my birthday for as long as I can remember. And I've truly savored each and every bite, dear. But maybe this is the year to teach the children your recipe. And you just enjoy eating breakfast with me. Nothing is going to stop me from baking those pancakes. Not even this broken arm. Well, you won't get any further argument from me. Now, can you please take your medicines? They'll make you feel better on your next inspiring adventure. All right. Fine. I'll take them. And I love you. You have always... You always seem to know what I'm thinking before I do. I love you too, dear. That was sweet. Agatha set us out to gather the ingredients she needed to make a large batch of freeze tonic. Of course, we didn't know that's what it was for, so we did what we were told, just like good princesses. Princess Graham, I think you've earned the privilege of a trip outside the tower. Yes, you and um, Princess B will go. You must return to me with a magical hourglass before sundown, before the magic wears off. Chester? Muriel? Graham? Graham! Oh, I almost didn't recognize you with all those bumps on your arms. Were you bitten by mosquitoes, boy? And if so, uh, could you point me in their direction? <laughs> Chester! So, what brings you to Tantalore? I suppose I could ask you the same thing. Oh, honey, we retired. Sold our shop to another crafty fella. Yeah, but his crafts are of the lowest tier. Folk art. Well, I'll always have a soft spot for that big-bellied bull. Without him, we wouldn't be soaking up all this sun. Oh, I just love it here. It's so quiet and peaceful. Oh, oh, don't you forget all you can drink sardine smoothies at Frog Dog Fridays. Chester, come on now. You wouldn't want to give this young lady the wrong impression. Us Hufflepots are known for thinking with our heads, and not with our bellies. Uh, uh, yeah, uh, uh, aren't you going to introduce us? Oh, apologies. How rude of me. This is V. V, meet Muriel and Chester, my good friends and wisest advisors. Pleased to meet you. And Graham is one of our favorite pupils. That he is. Oh, dearie, the stories I could share. He once outwitted a guard with a gourd. Oh, and then there was the time he solved a bridge troll dispute with a pair of socks. Did you know his best friend is a gerbil? A gerbil? Really? But he has a name. <laughs> it's Triumph. Most intriguing. Well, I would love to hear more sometime, and it's a pleasure to meet you. Likewise. Mm. <laughs> what is she doing? Oh, she's reading your fortune. Shush it! I'm judging. Mm -hmm. Good hair, strong fingernails, perfectly textured elbows. Mm, Earlobes could use some work. Mm. 
Thanks for that. She looks smart, Muriel. Graham, I think she's a keeper. <laughs> oh, you two will be very happy together. That's pretty forward. Muriel, times have changed. You can't just go around assuming... Just a humble paddle, you questioning my judging face! Oh, sorry, Muriel. <laughs> it was the sardine smoothie talking. Well, if it's not romance, why else would you be in beautiful Tanalor? Ah, uh, it's a long story, and I'm not... Wait a minute! Are my eyes seen straight? That isn't Hagatha's tower parked way out in the ocean, is it? Oh, you're not in cahoots with... Well, unfortunately, I'm not at liberty to say... Oh! She's always undercutting our prices! And her magic actually works! <laughs> I see you out there! You melty witch! Psst! Psst! Graham, do you think you could get Agatha to sign my copy of her greatest hits? Chester! Tell her to make it out to her number one fan! Are you serious right now? But Muriel, it's a bestseller! Oh, she's such a lizard! And not like the last dragon you faced, Graham. Which you... Which you... Wait, what did you do with that dragon again? Oh, the memory has faded. I set it free. Ah, uh, that's right. You failed to use your noggin. Please, just watch your back in that tower, Graham. Your biceps have grown, but your mind can as well. Muriel, it's getting to be that time. And what time is that? You know, time for a S-N-A-C-K. Oh, all right, Chester. Let's get you home. I think we have some leftover rat tails in the fridge. I am so glad you are my person. Please, both of you. Come back and visit us any time. It was amazing running into you. Oh, the pleasure was all ours. Goodbye, and good luck. Always look on the smart side of life. I knew I liked her. Wow. The Tantalor shore really is beautiful. I'm not sure I see it. Huh, what are you saying? Whale? <laughs> oh, careful. I think you've stepped in a pit of quicksand. Oh, have I? Really? Let me guess, you want me to take a moment to let that sink in? No, really, it's up to your ankles now. I understand you want to set me up for a pun war, but we've got work to do. All right, uh, don't move. I'll be right back. Uh, huh? Help! Help! I I'm stuck! Don't worry, I won't desert you. What a wonderful friend! One sec! Almost got it! <sighs> Hold still, you're making it worse. <laughs> oh, if that's the type of logic you think will help, you're dreaming. Very clever. You're welcome. I got you out of the last one. It's your time to shine. Did you try impressing her with your mind or your strength? This might be a little tricky.
King. <gasps> oh, calm down. There's nothing there. <gasps> Come on, let's keep going. You have a bow? Don't all princesses? I'll take this one. I got the next one. <laughs> I never miss. I got the one on the right. Bet I can shoot more than you. Bet you can't. Whoever shoots the most wins. Deal. You get the one on top. I'll take this one. I got the one on the left. You get the one on top. I got the one on bottom. Mine. Mine. Got it. I called that one. Hmm. It's not like I always have to win. I just never want to lose. Good shooting, I guess. Push it this way. Good move. Almost there. Good move. Not a bad team. 